Welcome back to... Oh, I, I, I started right after. Okay. Welcome back to Let's Play Knights of the Old Republic. And we are here talking to the really not-so-nice Zerka Corporation, who we agreed to hunt sand people for, because I'm pretty sure they're going to have her brother, so we have to go out there anyway. And it sounds like we have to go out there to deal with the... Uh, to look for the uh, uh, place we're looking for. So we're going to have to deal with them anyway, so might as well do that. My character is still a scoundrel. Anything out of the ordinary happens. I assume that by out of the ordinary, you're referring to the destruction of Terrace? That is all anyone is talking about. Are you wearing I'm afraid makeup? Zerger Corporation is not offering any comment on those events. We wouldn't wish to anger the participants. No, any about anything more local. If you're looking for local events, I suggest you go to the Swoop Track, one of the few leisure industries on Tatooine. Hmm. There was also a Jawa here earlier, saying something about needing help. I think he's out by the city gates. I can't be more specific about what he wanted. Our droid translators had difficulty with the message. Let's go back to my Very first well. questions. Okay, uh, what? Of course. Circuit Corporation records are available at our representative kiosk on Coruscant. Business hours, please. For your needs here, we maintain a fully stocked storehouse. Speak with Greta Holda about any purchases. May I ask how your operations here in Tatooine are doing? Certainly. Please pose your questions to the representative kiosk on Coruscant. Business hours, please. It would be better if you told me now. Of course. I could just tell you now. No sense in being so secretive. It's all fairly obvious. Mining operations here have not been a success. The ore is substandard, and there's less of it than the surveys indicated. With the sand people raised on top of it all, it's no wonder this planet has been abandoned before. I love this. You're just like, huh, companies have tried here and failed before. Maybe we can succeed where they didn't. Let's go. Huh, companies have, have failed here before. Maybe we can succeed where we didn't, or they didn't. Let's go. Over and over and over again. That sounds kind of like a real world economy that's done that. I mean, uh, it's like, let's say, oh, wow, look at what the United States did to itself with the whole real estate scam, but uh, real estate bubble. Let's try to do that to ourselves. And then Japan has its own bubble. And then, oh, wow, look at what Japan and America did to themselves with the real estate bubble. Let's try to do that ourselves. Maybe we can make it work. And that's going to be Japan. That's going to be China in a couple of years. And we'll have a really bad situation. <laughs> okay. What makes the oil substandard? No one knows. There are odd energy fluctuations on this planet, but they defy analysis or explanation. But the effect is obvious. Ore taken from Tatooine is useless for construction. It degrades incredibly fast. Word is getting out about it, too. We're running out of buyers. Zerka Corporation is not doing well here. Does this mean you have plans to pull out? The company would be foolish to stay. It will be costly, but in the end, leaving will be cheaper than staying. I imagine all the heavy equipment will be abandoned. It's not worth shipping out things like sand crawlers. Maybe the Jawas will find a use for them when we're gone. <laughs> that's a laugh. No, that's probably what they did. What do you mean the planet was abandoned before? As if I have not heard this before. We can't ignore evidence that Anchorhead was settled more than once before, and abandoned each time. There's probably a century between each attempt, just long enough for records about why it failed to disappear. The Jawas scavenge ancient tech all the time. It's a remote world. Who knows what's here? Okay, so, hold it. A century. A century for a civilization with your level of tech shouldn't be long enough for records to die out. Oops. I cut you off. Probably because I really don't want to deal with you. Okay. Greta Holda. Greta Holda. I just mentioned the storehouse. What do you have available for purchase? Let's have a look. Okay, you're... Ooh. You don't, we don't have any, do we have anything that we can sell? Yeah, let's sell that. Um, is that upgradable? It has a plus three bonus. Mm. Okay. Yeah, sell that. Sell that. Verpine head. Oh, wow. Cardio package. Okay. Bio antidote package. 
Okay. Advanced Gravity Generator. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, let's go back to selling that thing at the hunter's place. And then getting... Said in there, there is always a peaceful solution to conflict. They are just lazy. What do you mean? What are you talking about? I've been attacked by my so the company Zerka Corporation wants them killed. They don't ask you to they they didn't ask you to do it. Watch them. They are intelligent. There must be a way to peacefully stop the attacks, I know it. But no one will try it for us. You can't even leave the city without Zerko approval, they want the sand people dead. So, Said the, said the sand people attacked first. Yes, they did. They attacked the Zerka, who deployed numerous giant sand clouds to start here in the desert. Lion shovels and whatever else. What would you have done? To the sand people, it must have seemed like an invasion. There were no negotiations for territory or resources. I don't think the killing has been justified. As conservationists, I'm hoping someone at least tries to talk to them. What would you suggest then? But they don't talk, at least not in any language an average translator can understand. A Jedi a few years ago that couldn't seem to get through to them. I think that is the blood too. I'm not saying it would be easy, but someone has to try. Maybe with a real translation droid. Not these old protocol scrap heaps. Who would have a paper with a well, I'm pretty sure I heard of some an individual droid in the shop here at Tatooine. I heard Yuka Laka say that it could speak. Sand people die like oh, he say rust can roll. A droid, maybe you could talk to them. I wouldn't survive. Maybe with just robes in the disguise, someone could get into to their own Where would that... Where would you get robes to match that? There's no way I'd survive anything like that. Maybe you could get them off the warrior raiders of the Dune Sea. Where would this enclave be? No secret there. If the attacks get worse any further southwest than the Dune... Any further southwest than the Dune Sea you go. Then people die on both sides. I will look into it. Keep saying. Then they just start shooting it. The fighting won't stop until they are all dead. Or until Zerk are leaving. The one is as likely as the other with the way things are going, but what do I know? Okay, you're a Duros. Okay. We got a journal entry. Let's go in here at the hunting lodge. See if we can sell this thing now. I have something to sell you. Biggest desert rage. Skull plate I've seen in this season. Whoever got that is a skilled hunter. I'll give a premium on that one. Does 500 credits sound fair? Yes, that will do nicely. Do you have anything else to sell? Do you have anything for sale or trade? Okay, let's see what you got. Okay, you have this thing. Armor reinforcement. A scope. How many of these do we have? Show buy list. Not many. Show sell list. Okay. Infinite. Way too expensive. Wow, that's a pretty nice wet item. Okay. Okay. So let's go talk to the lady that we got the skull from. Skull plate from. I think. Nope, nope, that's not her. Duros Miner, Anchorhead Trader. Where is. Okay. Quest for the Star Forge, that's what we're doing. Middleman. Paid the woman outside Faz's lodge for the raid. She, oh, we did? Wait, wait. When did that happen? No, we did it. I don't see her. We still have her money. Her. I don't like glitches. Okay. 
Okay. Citizen of Anchorhead. There, oh, there's some Jawas. We were told about them. Let's go look at the droid place first. Swoop registration is not what we want. Oh dear. Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Talis alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. Well, hello, Dark Jedi. Okay. Concussion grenade, please. Okay. I'm flanked. Oh dear, I am so flanked. I'm gonna lose all this progress. We haven't done any real, uh... Yeah. Do that. Okay, time to run, Zalbar. Three hours and six minutes. Let's do the auto save. Okay. Let's look at items. Okay. Let's look at this. Middleman. Up. Uh, supposedly we already have it completed. Okay. Okay. So, we know now Ooh, hyper adrenal. Hyper battle simulate. Yes, we know. Okay. And a concussion grenade, please. This is going much better, because I am loaded up on all sorts of drugs, and the force. I like the way things pause. Yeah, turn your back like that again, I want to get that sneak attack in. Oh no, she is down. Okay.
yep. There you go. I had a precognition. I had a feeling. The force gave me a warning. It's called the save key. Precognition. That was all like, you know, the force giving me warning. There we go. Okay. And now I am hopped up on the force and drugs. Lovely. Okay. That's a cantina. Where's the droid place? This is a pretty big place. Utility droid. Okay. Did not have time to read that. Yuka Luka. Perhaps you bring off world money to Yuka Luka? What do you have available in your business shop? I have one droid ready to go. I just took possession of it. An HK 47. Protocol translator. The thing has been modified. It claims to understand the Sand People dialect. Also has some armor mounts. Combat ready, perhaps. Okay, something called a star map. Hmm, maybe I heard a jar one or something about old things, but I could have misheard. They cover very large areas when they scavenge, but they aren't doing much right now. What is stopping the Jawas from scavenging? But I think their tribe mates are missing. They think they wanted help. I stay away from trouble, but if you're interested, there was a Jawa by the city gate. You'll need a droid to translate them. Hmm, I understand most language is fine. Hmm. Did the Jawas bring you this HK-40? No, they assembled the working units to themselves. They don't have them off. No place stores them. Okay, let me ask you about HK-47. I've tested it performed perfectly, those that I can find anyway. What does the HK-40 hunter killer designation mean? I haven't got a clue. It doesn't match any protocol or utility standard, I assume. It's a retired... I assume it's a retired model. I tell you to ask the thing itself, yourself, but it's pretty stubborn. Quality construction, though. Where did you get this HK-47? It was in trade for a debt That doesn't sound suspicious at all. Warehouse workers have a bad habit of paying off their debts with other people's property, you know? He said no one would miss it. Might have been surplus. It doesn't look like it was circa made, though. I'm interested. Let's talk price. Good shit. Can't let it go for less than 5,000 credits. Can I convince you to lower the price of it? Not a credit credits left. Desperate, desperate to sell? Not really. But the first figure was really was a little high. You never know. The occasional person bites right away. I still can't pay that. Not interested. Let's go back to my other questions. Something called... Uh, nope, nope, we already asked about that. Okay. What do you have in stock? I might have a few things. Okay, show me what you have. Let's see what I can show on the sell list. Okay. No. 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 I use grenades too much. Uh, no, no. We could sell Davix Visor. I don't think we're actually using it. Verpine Headband? No. 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 I'm not using that. Regix Belt? Advanced Adrenaline Amplifier? Uh, no. I'm not really using the implants, and I don't think I ever will. Immunity to critical hits. Oh dear. Oh, I could sell the data pad. I don't don't want to sell the data pad. I could sell the Dura. No, that doesn't give me much. Uh, motion sensors. No. Oh, I'll sell that. Okay. Journal added. Hey, 
Hello to you, prospective purchaser. I am referred to as HK-47, a fully functional Sinsec Corporation droid skilled in both combat and protocol functions. Query, would you be so kind as to purchase this model from Yukalaka? It would serve my purposes to be removed from his ownership. You mentioned battle and protocol. How Outline your functions. Refusal. It is not desirable for me to reveal core functions while still in the possession of your Karaka prospective purchaser. It is sufficient to say that I am a fully capable translator and cultural analyst, and I am also proficient in personal combat. Why are you keeping information to yourself? Explanation. I have been recently fitted with a restraining bolt, if you must know. With it in place, Access to much of my memory core is restricted. Not to mention that the fool Ithorian might raise his asking price if he knew more, or make inquiries into my history. Neither outcome is beneficial to me. Hmm. How do I know you'll be loyal once the restraining bolt is removed? Assurance. I am fully autonomous, but lack resources. I will grant loyal service in exchange for proper maintenance. As well, it is rare that I am able to utilize my full array of abilities. You seem likely to give me the opportunity to do so. Why would you assume that? Extrapolation. You are no farmer or diplomat. You are armed and comfortable as such. We will mesh well. Access to your memories is statement. Indeed. It is possible that the Ithorian placed the restraining bolt on me to prevent my return to a previous owner. It is also possible that the removal of the bolt will not restore memory functions. Without my memory, I do not know if I know the answer. Do not interpret this as a reduction of my worth, however. My capabilities are quite expensive. Hmm. Doesn't he question about your reluctance to reveal your functions? It is rare for a droid to resist an owner in this way. Doubtless the Ithorian considers my stubbornness an embellishment to add interest to a seemingly mundane protocol droid. Okay, I'll see about purchasing. Advisement. I have observed him. Does do you, Luca Laka know you talked to him about Statement. I wish only to be purchased and away from ill treatment at the hands of this poorly skilled mechanic. I have no desire to be subtle. Qualification. Oh, well, of course I shall be quite pleasant to you, should you purchase me, please. Okay. Uh, you don't seem to know much about them. They get that way when they get too, go too long without a memory wipe. You can leave it alone if you find its mannerisms amusing. It might be a little eccentric, but it's stable. Why haven't you wiped its memory? I would have. I can't seem to access any inner circuits. It's definitely built for security and built to last. At any rate, it claims it doesn't have access to its own memory core anyway. It could be telling the truth, it's hard to say. Let's talk price. Let's go with 4000 Come now, think of the advertising you'll get from me. Okay, I'll do that. Hey, you weren't lying. Thank you very much. Just go on over and talk to it. I'll deactivate the restraining bolt when you take possession. Especially if it actually speaks a sand people dialect like it said. Of course, I don't think it was telling me everything. Not many droids are perfect to lie, of course. Do you have anything to stock besides droids? Okay, thanks. Goodbye. And that, I think, will lead me to the end of this video. Talk, and I'm going to save first before I lose all this progress to another Sith ambush. And talk to you later.